Hi guys, it's Vani from Ram TV again. The housing applications is already open, so I'm wondering what ASU students gonna choose for the next semester to stay. So my favorite residence hall is Centennial Village, even though I'm staying in Texan Hall right now. But Centennial Village is much closer to my classes holding every morning. So I'm hoping to move there in the next semester. I wondering what ASU other students want to choose for the next semester to stay. And let's go to see what their favorite dorm is. Let's go. <music> My name is Lorian Garcia. I'm a double major in animal science and natural resource management, and I graduate in 2026. Uh, my name's Cooper. I am a uh, student here. I'm a junior at Angelo State, third year. Uh, I'm a math and physics major and a computer science minor. Uh, my name is uh, Chan Satai. I am a freshman. I am currently majoring in computer science. My name is uh, Jaden Montgomery, and my uh, major is mechanical engineering, and um, it's currently in my first year. I'm Jasmine. I'm a freshman, um, and my major is pre-nursing. Uh, my name is John. Uh, I'm also a freshman, and I'm computer science. Sure, I am the Logan Huffington. My major is international business. I'm supposedly supposed to be graduating in 2027, but I take 21 hours, so I'll be graduating in the spring of 2025. Ah, there's a bug. <laughs> I'm currently staying at Texan Hall. I live in the Texan Hall dormitory and I'm actually a resident assistant so I live I, I live and work at the dorms. I'm currently staying in uh, Centennial. Centennial Village. Uh, I'm staying in Texan. I'm also staying in Texan. For the, um, these semesters, past semesters, I've been living in Centennial. Um, I really enjoy Centennial, yeah. I used to live in Plaza, but it wasn't really good at privacy-wise, so me and my roommate moved to Texan to get a little bit more personal space. Well, as an RA, I didn't necessarily get to choose to live there, but in my opinion, it is the best dorms to live in. Um, it, it is the most expensive, but you get the most bang for your buck. There's a movie theater, a community room. Everybody has a private bedroom. You only share a bathroom with your roommate. It's, uh, it's a really great place to live, um, and uh, the amenities are great. I, I like the community. I think it's a great place to work and a great place to live. Uh, I first chose it. It was a like a decision between Texan Hall and Centennial. Uh, ultimately, I landed in Centennial, but I chose it because it was uh, it had the private rooms. It looked pretty nice on the view, and it looked pretty modern and nice just to stay in. Uh, it's partly because uh, it's cheaper, but um, my uh, roommate's getting an apartment over the summer, and then he plans to continue having an apartment for the rest of the time he's here, so I figured it'd just be a good time to move anyways. I just thought it would be uh, better for me just because I'm not used to sharing a room with anyone. Uh, yeah, and I just prefer privacy. Uh, I got it for the movie theater, and I've never been in the movie theater, and it's kind of my life's biggest regret, so. Um, well, honestly, I mean, if you look at all the other places around, well, first of all, they, they force you to stay in the uh, dorms for a year, but we don't say that. But I mean, financially, if you look at all the other apartments, it's so expensive, like $800, and you like you don't even get the amount of space that you really, really pay for. But here, I mean, financially, it's only $3,000-ish for the whole semester. I mean, and it's only one little credit card swipe. It, it, that's all it is. I mean, you, I mean, if some people, they don't even use their own money, so they're not even thinking financially. I chose Centennial. Uh, I think it was a good place to go for me and my friends to stay. All four of us are currently going to stay there. And again, it has your own personal room for privacy. So it was a good idea for me. Which dorm will I choose for the next semester? Texan. Uh, I, I'll stay in Centennial. Uh, Plaza, probably. Plaza Verde. Um, I'm probably still going to stay in Texan. But if I weren't going to be in Texan, I'd probably go to like Centennial. Uh, hopefully I stay in Texan, but I might be going to Centennial next year uh, for the reason. Uh, sand Volleyball seems pretty fun, and I want to play Sand Volleyball. Um, I chose Centennial, but um, I mean, I, I think it's great for what you pay for, you know. Ah, there's a bug! But anyway, it's, it's, a good, it's a good dorm for what it is. You know, most campuses, like most, most colleges, you know, you don't get your own room. You have to, you know, 
share it with a bunch of people. Then you have to share a whole bathroom, like a, for the whole campus. Like you have to book an appointment to take a shower. Like what is this doctor's office? I've lived in Plaza, Texan, and Sinton, so I think I do enjoy moving around. And if I like Sinton, I think I'll just stay there. I don't. I do not have any plans. I love Texan. Uh, if I ever have the option to, I'd like to move to Texan, but right now Texan is full, so. Um, in the near future, probably not. I'll probably stick with Plaza after that. I have thought about the the vendor renter just because of like the kitchen area. Centennial, yeah, same volleyball. That is a really good question. Um, for me, probably not. Um, I think Centennial is one of the better, you know, dorms. Um, I, if I go to Texan, it's a little bit more expensive, and but I mean, everything else is closer, but Centennial, it's okay, it's fine. I mean, I can't really complain about it. It's only temporary. So that's all for the interview. I hope this can help you guys have some ideas about ASU dorms. Um, last but not least, don't forget to register for the room as soon as possible for the next semester to save for you guys the best suitable room. Also, if you have any more questions regarding the room or the housing or the dorms, don't hesitate to reach out to ASU housing staffs via an email or visit our school website to get more information about it. Thank you and see you in the next video. Bye!